Hello, world. I'm Chris Perillo. Welcome to my universe. Good news for all of you who have used either the developer or the consumer preview of Windows 8 as it's been released officially from Microsoft. Or maybe by the time you're watching this video, Windows 8 is in the wild. It's available uh, for you to purchase outright on a computer, or maybe you got it with your computer. Uh, do you miss that start menu, uh, the thing that Microsoft killed? Uh, we've got uh, at least three or four ways that you can bring back the old start menu or something like it in Windows 8. So if the one thing that was keeping you from upgrading from XP or 7 or, heaven forbid, Vista to Windows 8 was missing that start menu, uh, the article that we've linked here in the video's description may prove helpful, including an option for a power user menu. Did you realize that uh, that was available and it's, it's built right in to, to Windows there? Nothing to nothing to, to really do with it. Uh, there's also ways to customize that menu. You could also build your own. We've shown you how to, in this article, we've outlined step-by-step step how you can create your own start menu or something like it, or the closest thing, in the Arrow environment. Uh, the Arrow environment being the, like the classic Windows desktop, not the Metro environment for, for, Win, for Windows 8 with all the tiles. Uh, so for that, you know, we're even, uh, this is how we're doing it. It's kind of a, it's a clever little trick. Uh, essentially, you're creating a new task bar or a new toolbar in the task bar and then adding shortcuts to it. And you're creating your own start menu. May take a bit to manage, but it's pretty much the same thing as what the start menu was, just in a different place. And you can create it yourself, and it doesn't cost you anything if you have Windows 8. Uh, another option is uh, a free download currently from Stardock, something called Start 8. Then that will return a start menu uh, to uh, the Metro. Uh, interface, uh, and or at least the, the start orb that you've seen in, in recent Windows version. Uh, and then there's another one called Vista, and it's a horrible name, Vista Start Menu. Yes, named after Windows Vista, but according to our research, it will work just fine inside of Windows 8. So if you miss the start menu, you can have it. We've shown you how, where, why, in the article that we've linked in this video's description, feel free to click it and of course share it if you happen to find that it's useful information. If you know of another way of getting start menu-ish features back into Windows 8, feel free to leave a comment either here or on the article on LockerGnome.com.